Okay, so what's up guys, I'm Pixel Samuel. Welcome to this newest video. In this particular video, I'm going to talk about a new plugin for Premiere Pro. And these are templates which you can use in Premiere Pro and there are versions for After Effects and Final Cut Pro as well, which you can use in your videos and make some really awesome Instagram stories. And these are made by a company called Easy Edit. Yes, they are sponsoring this particular video, but I'm not liable to say anything good about this particular plugin if I don't like it. All the things which I mentioned in this particular video are totally my own opinion. Okay, so with that being said, if you guys like this kind of content and if you guys like tutorials on Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro, After Effects, free stuff, paid stuff, reviews and stuff, then do make sure to subscribe to this channel because we are very close to 100,000 subscribers. And I really, really want to reach 100,000 by the end of this year. So if you guys like this kind of content, do make sure to subscribe, do make sure to like, do make sure to comment and share with your friends. With that being said, this is Pixel Sammy and let's get started. So the purchase link to this particular product is there in the description below. So basically these are Instagram templates which you can use to make really awesome Instagram stories. It has tons of templates for fashion stories, for business stories, marketing stories, other kind of funky creative filters, transitions, overlays, test stickers, swipe ups, etc. which you can use in your stories to make them a lot better. Yes, you have to edit these particular videos in Final Cut Pro, Premiere Pro, After Effects, depending on the version which you are buying. And then after that, you need to import those particular footages into your phone and then upload it onto your Instagram. I know this is a bit of a hassle of a step, but the quality is what really matters here. And the quality of the final product which you are getting is really off the charts. And this is something which is pretty important when it comes to Instagram. So I want to give my basic review of what this package contains, some basics of how to use them, and some examples are on the screen right now which you can see and actually judge how you like this particular pack. So with that being said, I'm going to jump straight into Premiere Pro, but there are versions for Final Cut Pro and After Effects as well which you can purchase too. So with that being said, let's jump straight on Premiere Pro and see what this portal pack is capable of. Okay, so once you open Premiere Pro, make sure you have a vertical timeline, which is 1080p by 1920. And then after that, you need to open the Easy Edit Viewer by going to Extensions and click on Easy Edit Viewer. If you don't know how to install it, I'll link one down below to learn how to install it. With that being said, you are going to see this particular panel. Now, if you have not installed this particular plugin files, then click on this plus button. This panel is going to appear. Go to the download file which you have downloaded and then input this particular install file. And then after that, you're going to see all the files already there. And as you can see, you can view each and every one of them really efficiently. And this is what is going to save you guys a ton of time. There are basic stories, beauty stories, sports stories, travel stories, transitions, backgrounds, typographies. Let me go to any one of them just for an example. For example, let's go to fashion and click on any one of them. And as you can see, you can actually view the, each of the animations once you just drag your cursor over this particular Instagram story templates. And if you want to import any one of them, just double click on them. And then it is going to say locate in file. And it is going to say that some fonts are missing. If they are missing from your computer, you can download them from the internet. Otherwise, just use the default fonts which is there on your computer itself. And as you can see, this is what you are going to get. It is totally animated, totally already made. All you have to do is change the text, change the titles, change the pictures and all. And it is pretty much done. So you have to go to the audio template in the motion graphics panel. And then after that, you know, change all the text, such as this, hello, hi, hola. For the text too, you can type whatever you want. Basically, you are going to make your stories and type whatever you guys want to type in this particular stories. You can adjust the text, you can adjust the fonts, anything you guys want to do, you can do it here. If you guys want to change the position, you guys can do it here as well. So I'm going to just change the position of this particular panel because it is a bit on the lower side. It is going to look good this way. After that, as you can see, as these are all nested clips, you can double click on them and modify them in any way you want to. For example, I'm going to just change the picture. And then after that, I'm going to just import any one of the videos such as this one and drag it here. I'm going to just scale it up just like this. And then after that, once you go back to the original nested clip, you're going to see this particular story is totally already made. And as you can see, it looks really cool. Now, if I want to add some other elements also to this particular clip, for example, 
a kind of animation, some kind of a sticker, some kind of a swipe of effect, then I can do so with this AZ Edit Viewer as well. They have this in their package as well. And if I just scroll down, there are some other effects which you can use. There are many other Instagram story templates which you can use. But in my case, I'm going to just go to the stickers panel and see what this particular pack is capable of. For example, I'm going to just go to the stickers panel just like this go to text there are some really cool ones i'm going to import this particular hot template this looks really cool it is already imported now after that i'm going to import some other clips such as a swipe of effect these are some typographies which you can use these are some transitions which you can use currently i'm not using them but you are totally free to use them if you guys want to and in the arrows panel, I'm going to choose any one of the swipe of effects, such as this one looks really good. There are some other stickers also which you can use, but I'm not going to use them because I want to keep it a bit on the minimal side. And another thing this particular pack has is that it has sound effects too. It is loyalty free sound effects which you are going to get with this particular pack. And this is going to save you guys a ton of time because there are many people who are going to buy sound effects off the internet. But this is going to save you guys a ton of time. So I'm going to just readjust and reposition all the hot clips and the swipe of effects and all. And then after that it is going to look just like this. So this is how it looks and it is going to look really cool. There are some other examples also which is there on the screen and trust me on any level this looks really cool. And if you want to stand out in the crowd then you must absolutely try this particular pack. Okay, so Easy Edit has their own YouTube channel where they show tutorials on Final Cut Pro, Premiere Pro, After Effects etc. Also, they have their Instagram page which you can follow for updates and their website has some free packs also which you can absolutely try for free and use them with the Easy Edit Viewer. The links are there in the description below. So I'm sure you guys like this particular pack and I know that there are many packs out there which are similar to this but the best portion of this particular package is that the fact that there is an Easy Edit Viewer with which you can see and actually visualize all the templates at one go it really saves you a ton of time and that is one thing which i like about this particular product and if you guys are using easy edit viewer you guys can just drag and drop it onto the footage you are good to go. that is pretty much it and just made some minor adjustment to a test and picture and you are pretty much done so that is how simple this particular products are the one disadvantage this particular templates might have is that it might slow down your rendering speed a bit because it is a bit hardware and GPU intensive so make sure to just give it a bit of time while rendering because it is going to take a little bit longer than usual. That is pretty much it and I'm sure at the end of the day when you render you guys can just sip some coffee or tea if you guys like it and you're pretty much done. So with that being said if you guys like this particular video drop a like subscribe to this channel and this is Pixel Sammy. We'll be back with another video soon. Peace out.